Okay, this is a quick rundown on the Midnight Bones. He can be found in the um, under Genesis 9, under um, Characters, there's a Midnight Stories directory and another one called Midnight Bones. Now all you got to do, just double click him. He's in there, he comes with uh, how many? One, two, three, four, five, six different materials. Obviously the base one, black. This is a more darker boned one. Gold, metal, and a more saturated bone look. <coughs> He also comes with um, 10 different poses. I try to um, give it a, a good variety. This is a good one for um, those who, if he's dying in the desert or something. And that's a bit, a bit more of a religious one, sitting, standing, praying. The old rocky one, yeah. <laughs> uh, walk. And that's sort of like a zombie one. And of course, always with the zero pose to get you back to where you started. Um, where you can find, um, he comes only with uh, two built-in morphs, and that's uh, male and female. Well, obviously you're not gonna you're not gonna see too much with that. Um, like so, it'll just you know conform to those shapes but if you're going to con conform clothes um, to this one I'm going to suggest that you don't actually use the um, the base um, figure we'll just delete that well, there's one in the subsets. Now the subset has got Genesis loaded and switched off. So Genesis um, 9 is loaded and he's, <coughs> he's conform form to it and I've also left the eyes on there because some people have requested that I include um, one of them with the eyes in there and that's just the Gen Genesis 9 base eyes. Now why I say load, um, load in the subset is because um, you get to use all the Genesis um, uh, morphs and that that come with it not just the the shape morphs although it's not really meant for using with the shapes but it, it can be used um, but you can um, do all the uh, you know different different um, you know morphs using that and you've got Probably you're looking for ones that are in orange. The other ones probably won't work because they're shape morphs. And again, if you say so we do uh, this one, and as you can see, that that fits in um, reasonably well without doing too much damage. But uh, say Pixie 9, 
you can see that that one really tests the um, the smooth modifiers <clears throat> but well, I've got um, <clears throat> some some uh, morph helpers so under here you'll look under general under the the skeleton so um, we want to inflate the arms a bit And once the smooth modifiers kick in, it uses, it's not so fractured. So you might have to go a little bit higher. Yeah, and it smooths it out. Um, same thing with the thighs. And that gives you a much more reasonable looking skeleton than, than your originally had. Um, okay so we're going to reset everything back to zero again and I'll just show you uh, about the clothes. So I've loaded back in the um, the, the subset and um, we're going to set um, make sure you've got Genesis 9 of course selected so we'll just do the base um, feminine and we'll just uh, we'll conform some clothes to her Right, probably not a good one, not a good example because this one's not showing any bone poke throughs, but you can just see them there. And on see on the back as well. And a little bit there. Other other ones will um be a bit more um will poke through a bit more, but I've also got fit controls as well, which will help alleviate those poke outs. So select your skeleton again and go to your, your fits. Now I've got a, a fit body and that should clean up most of these ones here. And as you can see, they're all gone. I've also got um, some for the the head and the scalp as well. Like if you're doing hair or something, you want a closer fit, you'll just um, you just dial up the the scalp, which will bring the the head in align properly with um, Genesis. So. So basically that's all you need to know about the, the fitting and I, all, I suggest you always use uh, the, the subset for fitting clothes because um, that will conform to the, the hidden Genesis figure and give better results. So I don't think there's anything else I need to cover that should just about cover the lot. I hope you guys... Have some fun out of this and I'll see you on the other side.